Summer's here, school's out, and a lot of people are getting ready for vacation. But one thing you may not think about packing this year is a heightened awareness when it comes to COVID. As THV 11's Jay Jackson reports, state health experts are reminding everyone to stay vigilant with cases on the rise. Whether you're just more outside or active for the summer, or if you're gearing up for travel, Arkansas health officials say even with low numbers, you still want to keep in mind the potential for COVID cases. Last summer, we did have a spike in cases. That was a Delta wave. Now, we don't have the start of a new variant going on right now. We're dealing with Omicron subvariants. They don't seem to be causing that very steep rise. That doesn't mean things could change before the end of the summer. Dr. Joel Tumlinson with the Arkansas Department of Health says for the last five weeks, cases have been slowly and steadily rising, but the state's overall numbers are still low. He says cases are not going up at an alarming rate, but they are going up. Jay, you know, just like I do, have heard of more friends, family, other people you know who've come down with COVID in the last month than, you know, if that then was the case two months ago. Cases are going up all around the country, but here in Arkansas, hospitalizations haven't increased at the same rate. Coronaviruses generally are not at their worst during the summer. That doesn't mean we can lay off on our precautions. Dr. Robert Hopkins with UAMS says maximizing your immunity with boosters is how you can stay even safer during travel. Being outside more in the summer also helps limit the spread. Outdoor activities are good. Those are a lot safer than uh, doing things in uh, crowded indoor uh, places. Yes, we've made some great advances. Yes, we've got some treatments available. But we are not at the point where I think it's time for us to say this is just a flu. Dr. Hopkins says even with low numbers, there's this important thing to keep in mind. COVID is not gone. To give up on our precautions is to give the virus a chance to win. In Little Rock, Jay Jackson, THV 11 News. A reminder that everyone five years and older is able to get the COVID-19 vaccine. Meanwhile, Pfizer and Moderna are working right now to get FDA approval for that younger group.